everyone, welcome to Preeti's Kitchen. Today we are making an eggless carrot cake. This is one, one of my favorite eggless recipes. It is moist, delicious with a hint of spice. So let's get started. For this cake, we're going to use a 8 by 4 inches loaf pan, grease and dust it, line it with a parchment paper just like this. Let's keep this aside. Preheat your oven at 160 to 170 degrees Celsius. We take a clean bowl with a sieve. Let's put our flour in. If you're using unsalted butter, which I am today, a little bit of salt, baking powder, cinnamon, Next step is to just flour our carrots so that they don't sink in our uh, cake. I'm just going to take a little bit of flour from our sifted mixture. Coat the flour nicely on the carrots. Just about one tablespoon will do. And let's keep this aside. Okay, so we take our black raisins. We're going to soak them up for at least five minutes in warm water keeping this aside. Next, we take our butter. Sugar. Condensed milk. Honey. About two teaspoons. Feet. Now we add our flour, the soaked raisins, milk we'll add gradually, depends how uh, your weather in your country is. It's raining here so I'm going to go very slow with my milk because if the carrots are too wet then please uh, be careful with the milk content. You don't want your batter to become too wet. My carrots have been coated very well with the flour. This is a very important step. I'll add to my batter. Now the secret uh, in this recipe is I'm sharing is my caramel uh, syrup sauce that I have made. I'm going to use about one tablespoon of the ca caramel syrup. So the batter is into the tin. Always fill your uh, baking tin half full. Now this will go into my oven which has been preheating at 160 to 170 degrees Celsius. Bake it for 40 minutes because it's got carrots in it, it takes a little longer time. Uh, check at 30-35 minutes if your uh, it is cooked or not. In case you see a, a, the top turning too black, you can always put a foil on the top, just cover the top so that the top doesn't get too black or brown. So carrot cake is ready and out of the oven. Please cool this cake completely before you slice it. It is better eaten the next day because it tastes much better. The flavors are more in it. If you've enjoyed this video, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching.